is our first tape on this new camera. And uh, I thought with the aid of my assistant, we would show you the studio. Okay, on with the tour. There's some recent paintings and some not so recent. This I just recently had framed. Pretty nice, I think. And there's the old tree trunk. Uh, this one over here, Pete is uh, going to have. Got to get it framed for him next month. Uh, let's see. And of course, there's Kent's uh, poster. We had it framed for Phyllis's mother for Christmas. I thought I'd try to take another shot of painting of the girls. That's a little glare from that light, I guess. And I'm going to try another shot of the Christmas tree. Debbie's coming over pretty soon with the kids. We're going to watch them for a while. This is uh, tomorrow is Christmas Eve day. Let's see, if I'm shooting into the light, that's no good. Now, let's see. We just don't have our tree strategically placed. I'm going to try the backlight switch. Now, see if that helps a little. Not much, probably. Another shot of the picture and I turn the overhead light off. I think maybe that'll be a little better. Unfortunately, no more because you get a couple of feet inboard and you start getting into fuel cells and the fuel tanks and that's going to be difficult. That's why it never would have taken place. Now what's going to happen now is this aircraft, the Voyager, will be checked by the National Aeronautics Association uh, to make sure it's that it hasn't our landed proudest this position morning. Right here. This is to officially certify the record that the plane made an around the world non-stop flight without refueling. And uh, part of the thing is to make a big red cap. Make sure the plane has not landed. I'm shooting a little shot of Kent's house. I'm over to see him for a little while. So let me take a little shot. Let's see. They have a nice home. Uh, a little shot from the front. Let me take a do this as I'm walking on down it. Looks like you got a little company there. Hi, how you doing? Pretty good. It's going to fool the lens. And just like I'm looking at you now, and you're backlit, and I can barely make out your features. Yeah, but you aren't backlit, so it works out no, pretty good. Really nice. See, now there are a couple of artists. They all look kind of alike. <laughs> they, they have a, a, a similar look. Studio. A little dark down here, I suppose. Let's see. Boy, I don't yeah, want to shoot into that light. Level the chair. Here, then, let's get. Uh, here's the little set. This is in the picture. Yeah, right. If it's cut out of the picture, you won't have a problem. Oh, I see. Now you got this set up for. This is uh, where Sarah posed yesterday for the oh. portrait that I'm working on. That I hope to present to and or Sarah and I hope to present to Angela tomorrow night. Oh, tomorrow night. So I got two days to do it. Oh. <laughs> now he's sitting bet uh, between. This is the same set that I'm two. making for the second drawing of Oh boy, look at that light. I don't want to. No, don't aim into it. Just, just aim hold into a steady it. shot. But boy, he. I can see where this is a good setup. The recent painting of mine that Kent's had over here. Let's see what I can do with it. Hmm? Busy, busy painting. She had to have been excited when she saw that, huh? Yeah. As a matter of fact, a friend of Kent's has purchased it. Jim Barna. Looks pretty good. A 
little busy, eh, Paul? <laughs> That's fantastic. Check it out. Carol and Brady eat your heart out. Yeah. <laughs> What did you say about it, Paul? <laughs> Remember, Paul's an artist. Now, what did you say? Well, oh, I said something about this is really great. You, I, I think Paul is being nice to me, but no, no, I, no. I, what I said was, I told Carolyn Brady she should eat her heart out. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, she's she's considered hot and stuff. Is yeah. this another one that's on the works already? Oh, that's that an that's an old one. I wish you'd get rid of that. That's great. Yeah, you don't want it? Well, uh, this drawing is in progress. It's probably four days old. Four days? Yeah. I've got, uh, well, let's see, Saturday, Sunday. I would say five, four or five days what I've spent with it. I had to finish Tom Herter's mother. Um, oh, so that took good. some time. It's the, the, the interesting thing about showing it here is this is where she stood. Oh, and, it is. And this is the light. This is going to be the background, which uh, this rectangle of clay, which is not finished. It's just in the initial stage now. In fact, Jim Barnett uh, was my assistant on this project. What he did in an hour probably would have taken me four hours. So I'll come in and do the finishing work and then put the background in. And it leaves on the 8th of January, Federal Express, to get to uh, Miami on the 9th for a show uh, that the T-Chef is sponsoring that opens the night of the 10th. Uh -huh. That's great.